Hello class, today in MS Word video, we will discuss Insert Tabs Illustrations Group. In this, we will talk about how to insert picture, clip art, shape, smart art and screenshot. Okay, charts we will discuss in MS Excel. Okay, so first of all, we are starting with the picture option. If you want to insert any picture, that picture may be your any mobile clicked photo or any wallpaper or any of the picture downloaded from internet you can insert it here in your ms word how we can do it for that we have to click on this picture you will get this type of dialog box in this from here from this left pane you have to first of all select the drive or location where your picture is saved so i have my picture saved in d drive and this HD wallpapers. Okay, and you can see this uh, dialog box is small in size, and we don't have this maximize and minimize button here. So you can double click here. As you double click, it will be maximized. Now, suppose if I want to insert this picture, so you can either double click on it or you can single click and click on insert button from here okay as you do this that picture will be inserted look this is your picture now as you insert any of the picture clip art shape smart art anything you will get this format tab by default it is not available look as i click outside of this picture it will be gone look we don't have any format tab here but as you click on this picture it will be back so first of all if you want to increase or decrease the size you can go at any of the corner look as your mouse pointer turns to this drag it inwards or inside its size will be changed like this look okay then after after doing this change in the size you can use a format tab to apply any border to change its size like this look this one or this one this type you can change the border color using this picture border from here look like this you can apply the picture effects like shadow reflection look reflection i'm applying as you click on this you will get the reflection of the picture here look this is your original picture and this is your picture's reflection okay you can change the picture layout from here you can do the changes in the color or like this you can change the color of this picture by using this look changed like this so plenty of pictures options are there sometimes they are useful if you want to change the position you can change total line positions are there top left center left like this total nine positions are there you can try it if you want to crop the picture you can use this look suppose i want to crop it as you click on this you will get these corners now look click on this and then click on crop your picture will be cropped like this this is the way by which you can crop the picture okay next topic clip art now if anyone asks what is the difference between picture and clip art i can say they both are same the only difference is by using this pictures option you can insert any picture whether it is from your mobile or downloaded over the internet or any of the picture but clip art will allow you to insert the pictures that are given by the you can say microsoft programmers you can download the pictures from the microsoft website also but you can't insert pictures downloaded from your camera or any of the internet option okay that is the main difference otherwise they both are used to insert picture now as you click on clip art here on this right hand side you will get one window this type of 
this type of window now here you can write any name to search for a particular file or a, of picture but i am keeping it blank and i am clicking on this go button as i do this i'll get all the pictures saved in this clip art all the pictures all available pictures will be here now just single click you have to and your picture will be here okay again by look if i want to change the size or position i am not able to if you want to change the position you have to click on this then click on any of the option now you will be able to move it anywhere like this okay after that again this format will help you to change the border or whatever all the options will be same for all the graphics okay try it next one is shapes shapes will help you to insert variety of shapes look these all are the shapes if you want to draw any rectangle select from here and just do this okay now if you want to change the background color of this again format tab and here you have to click here we have different options or different colors you can select any one of your choice look you can change the fill from here like this you can change the outline color from here like uh, red okay effects that glow reflection will be available here also you can apply any one 3d rotation look it will change like this okay so these are your shapes next one is smart art smart art you can say they are the diagrams which helps you to write some data also i am clicking on this smart art as i do this you will get these boxes now here we have different varieties all list process look they are changing cycle hierarchy relationship matrix like this so if you want to go with this pyramid click on this and click on okay here you have your i am changing its position now look this is my pyramid now here you can write any text also suppose i want to write this a here i want to write this b here c like this if you want to increase the blocks you can click on this or you can click on this design add shape look added like this change the color from here you can change the colors this one they are available in the design tab okay you can move this up or down like this look right left okay so this is the way by which you can apply any of the smart art they are useful sometimes next one is screenshot i think all of you know what is a screenshot in your mobile also you are taking day by day so here also you can take but it has limited capability means it allow you to take a screenshot only of the desktop screen whatever is opened behind this software behind this ms word if you have any of the software open you can take the screenshot of it or you can take the screenshot of your desktop screen only otherwise if you say i can take the screenshot of any location it is not possible okay so as you click on this screenshot you have to click on this screen clipping as you click on this your ms word will be minimized automatically and your screen will turn like this blur screen now you have to press the left key from your mouse and you have to drag it like this okay the area where whatever you select do it now as you leave the mouse left button you will be in your ms word and here you have this screen okay this is called your screenshot now again you can do the changes like changing the size and border everything by using this format tab okay that's it for this video 
in this we have discussed illustrations group in our next video we will talk about this links hyperlink bookmark cross reference okay till then watch this video fully like and subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon so that you will get all the videos as i upload new ones okay thank you